Hello, everybody. Well, me and Jeff, I'm glad you're in here. I appreciate Char sending you. Um, hopefully, we'll have a good night. Hopefully, my notifications went out. Um, but it's good to see everybody, and I hope everybody's doing well. And I'm doing better. I um, had a little minor surgery last week, but I uh, definitely doing better. So. It is so good to see you. Um, all right, we have Noel back here. Hi, Hello. I was at the movie seeing the Ghostbusters. It was so so good. Was it? It was. It, it was number three. It, it was. It was good. Yay! I'm at the movies right now. Still. Can we sing a, a, a song or no? Um, yeah, I was going to get started. Do you want to go ahead and sing one? I can talk to you when I get to my house. Is that okay? Yeah, that's perfectly fine. I'll be on for a little while. Okay. <laughs> well, that was interesting. I've never had anybody come up at the movie theaters. That was kind of cool. Um, it's been raining here literally off and on all day long, which is horrible. Um, but it's been warm-ish, so that's been kind of nice. Um, we don't get snow where I'm at, so sometimes I get jealous of the snow. And uh, then when I hear what everybody has to deal with, I'm not so jealous. Hey, Chris, how you doing? Good to see you. I hope you've had a good day. Um, but it's been a decent day. I got a lot of stuff done just because it's been raining and icky. And my whole family decided to go off. So it's just me here with all the animals and the rain and you guys. So, um... Let's see. I was going to pull something up real quick. Um, yeah, that's what I'm saying, Jeff. I don't, I don't like shoveling snow. Um, I've literally done that one time in my life, and it was not fun. So I, I'm glad I don't have to deal with that. Oh, good, Mr. B. I was wondering if the notifications went out. I was not quite sure. Because... Um, Last week, or not last week, the week before when I went on, there were tons of people saying they never even got a notification. So I don't know. YouTube has a mind of its own. You know that. But yeah, no shoveling snow. Just tons of pollen, which made me thankful for the rain because that washed away a lot of the pollen. Thank the Lord. How are you doing, Mr. B? You doing good tonight? I saw Indy went live. 
I, I, I didn't even check for anybody. I know Deb's coming on at 1030. So I try to get off, you know, like a little before that, if not a lot before that. But I did not check anyone else's. <clears throat> but yeah, that I think maybe with the rain and the pollen being washed around, it's been wanting to settle in the back of my throat. So it's been great. Um, yes, sir, I should be on until probably 10, 10, 15. So I'm off in plenty of time for people to eat and relax before Deb comes on. So I'll be on at least that long. Well, I'm saying that that's Eastern Standard Time. It's 8.05 here right now. So a couple hours, unless it's just me. If it's just me, we'll be on about five more minutes. <laughs> Just kidding. Um, but I do have one that I typically kind of sing, and I guess I could go ahead and sing that. Maybe wait for some people to head in and head up. It's up to y'all. I don't mind. So we do country. Um, I do some country. I don't do a lot of country. There's my husband. Hey, Steve-O. I'm so glad you're here. Um, the link is pinned to the top, by the way, for anybody that wants to come up. So I don't have very many rules at all. Just be respectful to everybody, and y'all know that. Okay, sounds good, Steve-O. You can take your time. Um, I'll, I'll sing a song real quick. Um, I don't know if I'm going to sing every round just because my allergies going nuts, but We'll see. We'll go for it right now anyway. Same old one I seen. <laughs> On this endless ocean, finally lovers know no shame. Turning and returning to some secret place inside my head. Watching in slow motion as you turn around and say, Take my breath away. See? <clears throat> Sorry. Take my breath away. What can I keep waiting to anticipate the love? Never hesitate to become a painted one. Turning and returning to some secret place in the Watching in slow motion as you turn to me and say, My love. Take my breath away. Through the hourglass I saw you, and time you slip away. When the mirror cracked, I called you, and turned to hear you say. If only for today, I'm not afraid. Take my breath away. Take my breath away. 
dream of a nation, given this poet's love is made. Yes, Top Gun, you're correct. Blistering Barnacles, one of my favorite movies, and Maverick. Um, that made me want to be a fighter pilot, and I'm actually kind of a daredevil, believe it or not. But now I kind of get to live vicariously through my son, so that's kind of cool. But yes, I like that song. Thank you very much, y'all. And Jeff, you probably could. You could do that in the shower. Acoustics are great in the shower. <laughs> hey, Cheryl. Good to see you. Thank you. I really appreciate y'all coming in. It's, it's, it's humbling that anybody would even want to come in. It really is. I, I really appreciate all of you, each and every one. Um, let's see. I was trying to see what song I might sing. Uh-oh, did, did I take your breath away, Jeff? I'm sorry. <laughs> All right, we got Skibo. Hello. Hey, how are you doing? Good. Uh, just getting situated outdoors. Had to bring the laptop oh. out. Oh, I guess the weather's nice there. Yep, real nice. Getting ready it's for the sunset. I, Couple I, I, hours. I, look what shirt I have on. It says Jeez. Los Angeles. L.A. shirt. <laughs> <laughs> yep. I'm dreaming for LA weather. <laughs> <laughs> well, I've got it. <laughs> Jealous. Hey, <coughs> oh, Cheryl. Hello, everybody out there in chat. How's Buddy? Buddy, getting in trouble. Well, right oh. now he's he's out hanging around somewhere. But yeah, he went out the front door earlier. He knows he's not supposed to leave the front. Uh -oh. But yeah, he just went out front, got caught, got brought back in. Well, he shouldn't go out front. Mine know better too, but they'll slip out. But my neighbors know them. Thank goodness right. they don't get out that much, but my neighbors know them. So it's like, right. <laughs> your dog's out here. And it's like, sorry. No. Hey, Penny. I'm on a cul-de-sac. Not too many of the neighbors know a buddy, mm -hmm. but being I'm on a cul-de-sac, he don't get too far, or he hasn't gotten too far yet. Oh, <laughs> so, that's good. And I just got to teach everybody, there. don't chase him. Call him. Just stop. Yeah. Call him. He'll come yeah. to you because he, he wants to play. But if you're yeah. going to chase him, he thinks you're playing with them and he's going to run. <laughs> exactly. Yep. Yep. That's how mine is. So. I heard you're affected with your allergies. I only have one yeah. allergy. Uh oh. The only allergy I have is to stupid people. And yeah, when I get around stupid people, I break out in anger. My voice oh. raises, my voice elevates, and yeah. So I guess I have two allergies then. <laughs> and I got the same allergy. I just never thought about it as an allergy. Yeah. No, what's worse is when people think I'm stupid. That gets me. 
So, I mean, I don't have a problem with, with pollens and plants and all that stuff. It's people right. that bother me. Stupid people. <laughs> yeah. I understand. Oh, Jeff says his dog would be gone. You know, my little chihuahua will be gone. Right. And the Samoy the Samoyan that I grew up with, uh -huh. he would take off and he'd be gone for a week or so and then he'd come back. Oh but he 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 would take off constantly and then he would be gone for a week or two or the or the pound would get him and give us a call and then mama have to pay for him, whatever. Oh yeah, no. but yeah. He was always a runner like that. But that was back okay. in the seventies. <laughs> To say something funny, okay, my little chihuahua is Bentley. And for short, we always have called him Mr. B. And Mr. so, yeah, Mr. B will get out. And when you get in the car, you pull up to where he is. He stops and looks at you. So you get out and you get about that close to him. And right. he'll take off again. He'll take off. So you hop back in the car. But if you sit now and open the door and ask him if he wants to go for a ride, He'll come around He'll come and jump in. right back in. So right. I take him for around the block and we come back. So. Oh, you're you're fine, Penny. I, I get that. When I was managing the mobile home park, I had a Akita Chow mix. And Ooh. it was it was getting accustomed to the yard. But it got out this one particular day. I had it maybe two or three weeks at that point, and it got out of the yard. So I went to go get her, and we called her Shadow. Her originally, when we got her, she was named Indigo. Oh, the kids! The kids at the time, you know, it was a problem for them to say Indigo for right. some reason. But because it always followed me around, I kept calling it Shadow. There's my Shadow. There's my Shadow. Mm -hmm. So I I named her Shadow, and the kids started calling her Shadow instead of Indigo. Anyway, three weeks after we had her, she got out. I went chasing her. She got out of the park. She's on a main highway. Or, you know, and I don't mean like a real, I'm in a rural area. So the highway is just fast speed. It's not a bunch of traffic like in LA or whatever, like, you know, a freeway. It's not a freeway. Like the it's, one a one. Highway. it's a highway and it has fast traffic. Mm -hmm. Well, she went up the highway and that runs right alongside the mobile home park that I manage. So I'm going after her and I'm yelling at her, bitch, get back here, you know, blah, blah, blah. And somebody from the mobile home park, don't you be hollering at that dog like that. I shut the fuck up. That's my goddamn dog. I'll <laughs> holler at it like I want to. You know, and oh. I'm hollering at the resident of the park. I'm the park manager. <laughs> now I'm yelling at the, the resident. I'll yell at my freaking dog any way I want to. You shut the hell up. You know, and I was angry because when I approached her, she ran further from me. That's what ticked me off and got me yelling and hollering. And then the neighbor hollered, don't you holler at that dog like that. Don't you tell me what to do. And I started hollering back at You know, would you rather <laughs> see the dog killed on the side of the road? Come on. Yeah. Lord. So. People. <laughs> Name but. your dog Fur. Is that how you say that? Fur? I had a buddy name his dog dog okay hold on i'm trying to catch this it's got to be a joke fur. come here fur i don't know i'm not catching it name yet. your dog fur effort here for, here effort. For effort i got it effort <laughs> effort, <laughs> got <You> effort. <laughs> oh you see yeah. that's a buddy, kind of mine, cool. a buddy of mine named his named his dog dog and i told him what's your dog's name he says dog that's really you call him dog no i call him dog i says what he says, yeah my dog's name is dog and if he ever gets away from me and i have to go out looking for him i don't go calling for dog i go out calling for dog dog he knows how to spell okay cool as far as I'm concerned, your dog's name is D-O-G. Yeah. <laughs> That's what you call him. That's his name. D-O-G. Yep. yep. No. Dog's name is Dog. <laughs> My husband's best friend growing up, they had a dog named D-O-G. And that was his name. D-O-G. So, D-O-G? Yeah. 
Yep. Yeah, that's, what, that's what I told my buddy. Your dog's name is D-O-G, dude. It's not dog. It's D-O-G. <laughs> oh, I had one, a dog. His registered name was Rushing Turbo, but we called him Turbo. So right. that's funny. My cousins had a dog that was in the Guinness Book of World Records. It was a St. Bernard, and the head was the largest canine head that they had measured, I guess, on the Guinness Book of World Records. But back in the 60s and 70s, you can get into the Guinness Book of World Records by just coming up with something. You know, you're the first one to, you know, measure a dog's head. You know, yeah. but yeah, it was a St. Bernard and I think it was 70 something inches. I'm not sure exactly what the measurement was, but it was oh. in the Guinness Book of World Records. She was a thoroughbred or I guess papered, you know, uh, her original name was Miss Duchess or Duchess something or other. She had, you know, a big name, but when we had her. We called her Bridget. She was Bridget. So, <laughs> but she had a a royal name, I guess, in the canine world. But yeah, yeah it was measured out from named, the end. We had a dog named Princess Guinevere. We called her Gwen. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Crazy. And the Samoan that we had, it had papers, but we had gotten it through a friend of my mother's. Uh, a lady my mother worked with actually mm -hmm. bred the Samoans. And mm -hmm. she ended up hooking up with the guy that also bred Samoans. So when they got married, they had all these Samoans. And the one that we ended up getting, the woman had gotten from her mother as a pup. So when she gave it to my mom... <coughs> mm -hmm. She didn't give her the papers or anything because she had explained to her mother that the dog had run away and that the dog was missing. So she retained the papers on the dog, but we didn't care. It was a pet for us, you know. Yeah. But, yeah, the, the woman ended up telling her mother, a little fib, that the dog ran away from, you know, from her. And they had all these other dogs to take care of anyway, so. <laughs> but, yeah, he was... Uh, no, he was a paper dog, just we didn't have the papers. <laughs> but yeah. he was a runner. He did turn out to be a runner. He would take off for weeks on end. And at one point, my mother's boyfriend had sold him. A, my brother, two of my brothers were in the All Star Baseball League team, yeah. and they ended up having a game somewhere, and they took the dog with them. And my mom's boyfriend ended up selling the dog. When they were on this trip, they came back without the dog. And my mom found out about it, and she was real upset. That's what split them up. They ended up breaking up over it because he got rid of the dog. And <clears throat> mom basically gave him the boot after that. The following, it was somewhere around Thanksgiving, Thanksgiving or Christmas, somewhere in that area because it was the holiday season. The dog was a couple blocks from our house chasing a cat up the tree. The person had gotten the tag number, and it was our old tags that was on the dog. So when they called the animal control, animal control gave them our number, mm -hmm. and my mom had to go get the dog. And that was our best Christmas gift. It was like a week or so before Christmas Aww. because that was our best gift was we got our dog back, and he was gone for months at that point. It was like three to six months or something like that. Wow. So, yeah. I'll take it. Well, so, yeah, the dogs are part of the family, too. <laughs> they, become, sure. they become a member of the family, for sure. Yes, same. Yep. Our sleep in the bed with us, except for our German Shepherd. And it's just because she doesn't prefer to sleep in the bed. She likes her dog bed. So Right. I was like, buddy, I'll have him jump up on the bed with me, and he'll lay with me for about three to five minutes. And then he's down at the foot of the bed again. He's either at the foot of the bed, at my bedroom doorway, or he's at the living room doorway. Mm -hmm. I, I mean, he's he's a guard dog. He's like, <laughs> he's like right where I'm at, or he's at the, guarding the room I'm in, 
<laughs> or he's at the living room door guarding whoever's coming in and out. <laughs> yep, my shepherd always sleeps with her head towards the main door, wherever she is. So, oh, buddy lays up against it. Oh, if you're well, in, when my here. daughter comes home from work, because my daughter works graveyard, and if Buddy's out there at seven o'clock in the morning when she's coming home, she's got to push him out the way with the door. Come on, Buddy, wake up, move. <laughs> now the the Chihuahua and the Chihuahua Min Pin mix. One's on my right side, one's on my left side, under all the covers, dead asleep. So yeah, they're. Oh, but, cool, Mister B. Tom. He says, "Give him oh. a few minutes." Okay, He's probably going to go after a sandwich or something. <laughs> of course I want you to come up, Mr. B. Yay. Oh, Jeff's dog, dog has a chair. My dog has a chair when we're in the living room, like watching movies. She has her own designated chair. And I buy chair covers, and then I'll right. just switch them out, you know, for the dog. Yeah, We're crazy. I know. But Buddy's oh. learning real quick to stay down because when we first got him, he always wanted to jump up on people. And now I'm getting him to keep all four on the floor, Buddy, unless somebody asks him to come up. Because I'll do that once in a while. I'll pat my butt, my belly, and then he knows, okay, I can jump up there. That's how I <laughs> it is, unless we yeah. tell her. And then we have the pool, and she loves the pool. So we're trying to teach her don't get in unless we tell you to get in, but we're right. having a hard time with that. But speaking of that, my legs on the top looks like I've had a really good time, but or got beaten. But when I was going to my daughter's house to give her goats their shots, she's got a big dog and he loves just pawing. He won't jump. Oh. Well, she won't jump. She just paws, but she paws really hard. So right. I have all these bruises and scratches on my legs. <laughs> Uh, so Donna's eating chicken and dumplings. Chicken and dumplings. Mm. Sounds good. Jeff's dog's mean. He said, don't touch. That's okay. As long as you can touch them. Nice guard dog. <laughs> Did you have a song pulled up yet? Or have you had time to? Uh, yeah, what do I have over here? Oh, yeah, that's right. I got a stick song up there. Oh, We're going to well, go with what? some sticks. Sticks. Oh, yay. Well, let me present, and then you'll see. Oh, maybe you won't. Oh, this okay. one ain't sticks. This is the other one. Wait, hold on. I clicked on the wrong one. Let me cancel that. Because there's two songs that I found today. I found two songs today, and they're both the same title. They're both from mm -hmm. two different artists. And they're both really good mm -hmm. songs. But mm -hmm. I'm going to do those later. I want to start with those. Come on, mouse. Start working right. Hold on a minute. I'm fighting with my mouse again. You're fine. Kirsten has four dogs, three birds. She's babysitting a 120-pound golden doodle and a very fat old dachshund. Oh, my goodness. Sounds good, Donna. Let's see. Jeff's excited about sticks. Um, Oh, come on. Where are my songs at? I just put them in today. They got to be at the bottom of the file here. Oh. Yeah, my dad has a, a golden doodle, and that dog has the longest eyelashes. I tease and call her Maybelline because her eyelashes are so long. It's like blink, blink. She's beautiful. Hey, seven ten. Good to see you. Cheers. Um, the link is pinned to the top. If anybody wants to come up with me and Steve, -O. yeah, Steve was still trying. I'm gonna have to cancel this screen. Hold on a minute. Let me get it out of this file and bring it back up again because it's messing with me. I guess you call her Maybelline, I'm sure. Call her May. Or Mabel. I don't know. Yeah. So cute. Clear that. 
Well, I don't oh, know I why just... this. Oh, it's the mouse or the computer. It ain't responding right. There we go. Finally. Did you put batteries in your mouth? Yes, I did. But it's still acting up on me. Because I'm uh, trying to use my Kindle as a mouse pad. Kristen says. Trying to do all my dragging and everything on the Kindle because I'm outside. Kristen and says he's pretty and it's a good thing he's cute and doesn't need his brains to get through life. <laughs> <laughs> Who's she talking about? Me? <laughs> <laughs> um, I just got a notification. In Tampa Bay, there is a man that carjacked an EMS vehicle, and he's still on the loose. So those in the Tampa Bay area, watch out for EMS. Hopefully they'll catch him. Why does my hair look green in this light? Okay. Well, I'm going to go with the sticks. Okay. Yeah, this one here. I said there's two songs, same name. Okay, let me click on this one. Hopefully, it's the right one. I want the sticks one, not the other one. Because I'm going to be doing them both. I just want to do the sticks one first. Okay. Now let's see. Oh, cool. No commercial. It's going to go right into the song. Let me. No, oh, wait. Come on. There. Pause. Now present. Share, share that one, and share. Now it should be there. There we go. It is there. Now I can show you the way. Show me the way by sticks. And then you guys can figure out who else does show me the way. Every night I say a prayer in the hopes that there's a heaven. And every day I'm more confused as the saints turn into sinners. All the heroes and legends I knew as a child have fallen to idols of clay. And I Fill this empty place inside. So afraid that I'd lost my faith. Show me the way. Show me the way. Take me to the night, to the river, and wash my illusions away. Show me the way. And as I slowly drift to sea, for a moment dreams are taken. I close my eyes and know there's peace in a world so filled with hatred. That I wake up each morning and turn on the news to find we so far to go. And I keep on hoping for a sound So afraid I just won't know Show me the way Show me the way Bring me tonight to the mountain And take my confusion away And show me the way And if I see the light, should I believe? Tell me how will I, I know?
Show me the way. Show me the way. Take me tonight to the river and wash my illusions away. Show me the way. Show me the way. Give me the strength and the courage to believe that I'll get there someday. And please show me the way. Every night I say a prayer in the hopes that there's a heaven. Show me the way. Oh, that was good. I hadn't heard that in a long, long, long time. Hey, Jeffrey. Good to see you, dude. That All right. And Christian. Wow, Christian's right on it. When I asked who else did the song. Well. Peter Frampton, show me the way. Huh. I never realized that, to be honest. Yep. Totally different song, though. It's not the same song, same title. Yeah. Hmm. Uh, Jeff says that was almost at my fingers. <laughs> okay, I don't like the people watch me sing because I make faces. I think I always make faces. So, let's see. all right, we ready? I might sing this one.
And if I chose the one I'd learn to help me through, I'd like to make a big move. I really think that we could make it through. Very nice. <laughs> Nicely done. Thank you. Oh, Jeff, this is the lounge. And I mean, anybody can come up. You don't have to sing. That's kind of how I yeah. like it. That's right. Hang Thank you, Jeff. I appreciate that. Yeah, come it rained <laughs> afternoon here. And it's supposed to rain here tomorrow, too, Jeffrey. Blech. Go ahead, Steve. Oh, sorry. Huh. Well, I got my garden sprouting. I got a little sprouts popping up of cantaloupe, green beans, uh, cucumbers. Those are the ones that have popped. Still waiting for the corn to pop, though. Not popcorn, but uh, stocks of corn. <laughs> 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 Thank you, Chris, and then purple. Oh, uh, yes, now, seven ten. Come up and be the backup dancer. And now, all of a sudden, my brother-in-law's starting to show some interest. He's going to start planting some seeds. I've nice. been working this part. I, I've been I've been working on this compost pile. I've been turning soil, doing all this work, preparing for a garden. And now that the stuff that I planted is starting to pop, today he's going to start planting some seeds. I'm thinking, where are you going to put them, dude? Where are you putting them? I, I'm working on my garden. I don't know where he's planting them. But anyway, I'll incorporate his stuff with mine. <laughs> it's just funny, though. I get all the work, the, the hard working part done, and now he wants to come in and just plant some seeds. And yeah. I'll be the one out there watering it and tending to it and de-weeding the garden and all that good stuff. And of course. Yeah. And then he'll he'll show up when it's time to harvest. <laughs> I understand that. Um, <laughs> seven ten, you know what? At this point, if you have a stripper pole, I think it'd be entertaining to see you on it. How's that? Oh yeah. Happen? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know they've made portable ones. I didn't know they made them YouTubeable though. YouTubeable? Yeah, I mean YouTube. I mean, <laughs> <laughs> I've seen stripper poles in establishments. I haven't seen a stripper pole on YouTube yet. I don't know if YouTube will allow it. <laughs> okay, is my, is my volume low or is it better now? I bumped it up. I'm hearing Penny you fine. Oh, uh, Penny said if if I was low to anybody else, I turned it up. Maybe that'll help. Okay, let's see. Where did I put my volume at? Uh, let's see here. Laptop volume. Oh, you know what? I need to check that myself. Okay, oh. My laptop volume is at 60, which is about average. Uh, usually I stay around 50. On my laptop volume, I usually stay around 50. I bump it up to 60, 65 on some people that are low. See, I bump mine all the way up because I can control it by my hand. So my volume was at 50% penny, so I hope this is better. So <laughs> Kristen wants to know if YouTube has is become a U poll. I wouldn't be surprised. 710 said, oh, do you eat yeah. Pepper is asking, do you eat pepper, Steve-O? I put black pepper on my food. I will eat a stuffed bell pepper. I do add some peppers to, as seasonings to my food. But, yeah, as far as eating a pepper, like those Italian peppers and stuff, no. A jalapeno, like no. Peppers, yellow peppers, green peppers. Yeah, that's what I'm going to be growing, bell peppers. Bell peppers, they start out green. And they grow yellow and red. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I have a, what did they call it? Uh, the ones that I planted is, a, it's a mixture. It's a blend. It's got all of them. Anyway, I got a mm -hmm. row of those. 
but I like the bell peppers and stuff like that. I usually use the peppers as seasonings. I don't eat them like, you know, like jalapeno pepper poppers. <laughs> gotcha. My son ate a habanero one day. Took a bite. I'm not gonna say he ate it. He took a bite. Woo! He was hating yeah. life. Well, one of the mobile home parks that I managed, there was a, a Vietnam veteran that lived there. And he had brought over some Vietnamese peppers, and he was growing them in his yard. And they were just little bitty peppers. They were small little things. And he says, here, try this. And I grabbed it, and I pinched it, and I smelled it. And I says, no, thank you, sir. I can smell the spice in it. It's too hot for me. Well, I told my nephews about it, and I was having a barbecue one day. And one of my nephews went up and made my brother a hot dog. And he put one of those Vietnamese peppers in the hot dog for my brother. When he gave the plate to my brother, my brother turned around and opened up the hot dog. And he saw that pepper sitting in there. And he says, thank you, son. And he pulls the pepper out. He says, but I don't need this. And he sets it aside. And his son looked at him and says, dad, you're a chicken. And my brother looked at him and says, you eat it. And so he grabbed it and he bit into that thing. I ended up losing a half gallon of milk. I mean, he he bit into that Vietnamese pepper, and you can instantly just see his face just start going red and red. And he ran in the house, and he turned on the faucet. He started drinking the water. He turned the faucet off, opened up the refrigerator, grabbed the half gallon of milk, and just started chugging. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> it's like, no, I don't do peppers. <laughs> Jeff says my, older funny. Older funny that my brother knew if he's serving me a plate, there's got to be something. So he opened up that hot dog and saw that pepper sitting there. Wow. <laughs> Did I you love see these Jeff memories. says my old girl was a pepper? <laughs> hey, I like drinking Dr. Pepper. Does that count? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, really. Liquid pepper. <laughs> Uh, My favorite. In fact, I have some right here in this big old thing. I used to drink Aww. Dr. Pepper, but Pepsi is my choice. I've gotcha. basically from the age of, I will say, just to be honest and safe about it, from mm -hmm. the age of 21 to currently, mm -hmm. I have drank a six pack of Pepsi a day, minimum, at least. Wow. Those cans right I there. Have one of them. Mm -hmm. 12 fluid ounces. Six mm -hmm. of them minimum a day. Wow. And the doctor I says, no, I'm at risk of being a diabetic because my system's already adjusted for it and I don't have to worry about it. According to my mm -hmm. doctor, and my system's mm -hmm. fine with it. Mm -hmm. Okay. I used to drink a lot and. And I got on this kick where it was like, okay, I'm going to do one a day. And I, I stick to one a day. So, because yeah. I could well, do I six. Know, I know if I ever want to lose weight, which I am overweight, okay, but I feel that I'm at a healthy weight. Although mm -hmm. it's overweight, you know, I still feel healthy with it. But I know if I wanted to lose weight, all I got to do is stop four of those Pepsis a day. Cut yeah. it down to two. Yeah. I'll be down in two weeks. <laughs> yeah, when you know, I cut back, I've dropped 20 pounds since I cut back to one a day. So yep. that was like a year and a half ago. But Right. Yep. But my oh, body yeah. changes with the seasons. If I'm indoor all winter, I'm an old bear, and I'm just going to put on weight because I ain't doing Same. anything. I'm inactive. Bring on the okay. spring and the summer. I'll be out there burning it off. Yep. So I will be burning oh, this so off. And to, unlike a bear, they put it on in the summertime and summer and fall in order yeah. to go hibernate. I'm the old bear. I stay indoors and just feast, 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 feast. Eat, eat, eat. <laughs> 710, I, I have been forbidden to have tea. I have kidney stones, and they found that if I drink tea, I produce them. So I had to give up tea. 
and I loved tea. Sweet, southern sweet tea, my favorite. But I can't. Okay, so I'm going to be doing, uh, I'll be doing sun tea during the summer. I'll still do my six pack of Pepsi, but mm -hmm. because there's so much syrup in the Pepsi, it causes all that phlegm in my mouth and everything. So in the summertime when the heat and when I'm really active, I will drink mm -hmm. lemonades and iced teas. So I during the summer, I will, oh, and my favorite is the Otter Pops. I got a big old box of big old long Otter Pops in the freezer right now. That's my favorite in the summertime. Chunks of sugar watered ice. I know what you're talking about. Yeah, Otter Pops. Frozen frozen water. <laughs> the okay, flavored seven frozen water. Your <laughs> but kidney stones are like that big. I mean, it's not the little kid size. They yeah. they got the jumbo ones now. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Seven, ten years must have been like calcium deposit. Mine were more like a uric acid combination. So, yeah, I can't, I cannot drink tea. I so have been say. fortunate enough in my life that I haven't been sick enough to have to go to the doctor. I have really been lucky that way. No kidney stones. I did have a gallbladder removed. Okay. And that, even that was a big screw up because I was having problems and I went to the gastrologist to run a scope to see what's going on because I was getting that, I don't know what, you acid influx or whatever. I was getting bowel flavor in my throat. I'm like, mm -hmm. this ain't right. Mm -hmm. So I set up an appointment. I went in to see the guy to examine the gastrologist, right? He does your intestines and all of that, right? Okay, That's you're the right guy. I go to him, mm -hmm. and he sees that I'm sweating when I went and saw him. He said, man, it's not hot in here. The air conditioner's on, and you're sweating. And I feel you might be having a heart attack. I'm going to send you down for an EKG, blah, 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 blah. I'm like, dude, I'm here for, you know, I got this pain in my stomach, blah, blah, blah. He yeah. sends me down. They put me on the EKG, do, you know, whatever they need to do to check my heart out. Yeah. They do a blood sample on me and send me mm -hmm. home. I was what? home for less than an hour. The doctor's on the phone telling me, I need you to head to the local emergency room and have them give you an antibiotic. Your white blood cells are up, blah, 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 this, that, and the other. I need you to go in right now and explain to them, give them my number. They can call me and I will be heading there, you know, and he wanted to know what hospital I was going to. Mm -hmm. And he rushed right to the hospital. I went in and I told him, the doctor wants me on an antibiotic right now. Here's his name. Here's his number. I visited him today. He called me and told me to come down. Mm -hmm. They put me in the room. He shows up, and they ended up doing whatever they needed to do, the ultrasound or whatever. And they mm -hmm. told me that my gallbladder, that's supposed to be the size of a small mouse, was the mm -hmm. size of a large rat. Mm -hmm. Wow. He says, you know, so they went in and did gallbladder surgery. Mm -hmm. And I looked at that doctor. I says, when I showed up at your office, and I told you I was having problems with my stomach, and you sent me for the damn heart thing. What was that mm -hmm. all about? Oh, I mm -hmm. thought you were having a heart. No, I was having a gold, gold bladder or whatever. You know, okay. yeah. mm -hmm. I don't go to the doctor unless something is wrong. And even when I yes, do go same. to the right one, they send me to the wrong one. So, oh, my God. That's crazy. You know, mm -hmm. And unfortunately, mm -hmm. I'll be the one that's not going to go. And I will probably drop from something that could have been prevented had I gone to the doctor. Mm -hmm. I don't know. I'm sick. <laughs> That's just, just me. You can't win. I know. Yeah. Hello, Glow. Welcome Hello, aboard. How are you? <laughs> I can't. How are you? I'm, I'm so okay. glad you're up. Yeah. I love hearing you sing. Oh, yep. thank you. Yep. See, we're just up here shooting the, yeah, just blowing it till we get these fingers up here. <laughs> <laughs> I figure I better go in there and break up this uh, little love fest here. <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah, we needed a chaperone. Thank you, ma'am. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Uh, you know what? I have a story to tell about a chaperone really quick. I'm going on a field trip with my granddaughter, right? It's like in April. 
my daughter asked if I can go with her. I said, yeah, I can go. So she sends me this link that I have to go in and study and take these tests. And if I pass them, I'm allowed to go. And oh, my goodness. Now I am a mandated reporter with our county um, for any type of abuse. Um, I had to sign that. Uh, I had to do a S harassment module and pass that. Wow. To go on a field trip. Have y'all ever oh, heard of that? Trip. You yep. think it's yep, it's our government to turn us all over and just make this. Oh my gosh. They, they want you to sign a contract. Basically, what you did was you signed a contract stating if you see anybody mistreating a child, you are to report mm -hmm. it, period. Otherwise, you are in violation of the law because you I signed it. So now they're going to hold you responsible now for an injured child because you didn't report it. Blah, blah, blah. Right. That's our government. That's they want to regulate I would us. Rather them, mm -hmm. I'd rather them do background checks on everybody before they let them on a field trip. Background check. You pass right. that? Come on. But taking all, right. all these modules and tests, yep. I'm like, oh, my goodness gracious. This mm -hmm. world. I my grandkids. Mm -hmm. I took my grandkids to one of those trampoline parks. Right? Mm -hmm. They want to go play on the trampolines. Cool. Let's go. Grandpa's yeah. springing. I take them mm -hmm. in there. No go. They would not allow my signature for the kids in case they got injured or liability or whatever. They had. I had to contact my daughter, and my daughter had to. Re I'm like, come on, they're my grandkids. For God's sake, you know. Nope. It no. has to be the parent. You know, unless you're the legal guardian and. Mm -hmm. I'm like, this is ridiculous. You know, people are going overboard with all this, you know, uh, liability. Yeah. Who's liable for what? Mm -hmm. You know, I'm that sorry. If you're hurt at a playground, the kid's going to learn. Don't do that again. You'll get hurt again. That's right. how I grew up. I didn't grow up on oh, to sue the manufacturer of that slide because I hurt my ass because the sun was too hot shining on that hot metal. You know? We didn't sue the toy manufacturers back then. Oh, now that's what people, parents do. They go and look for the most dangerous toy so they can bring up a lawsuit against that company. You know? It goes. Turn backwards. I'm sorry. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not up here to You're fine. So, quote, <laughs> do, do you have a song ready, quote? Uh, yeah. I, yeah. I do. All right. Go me? for it. Okay. Um, this will be my first time. Or second time doing this one. I practiced awesome. it before my way. end is near and so I face the final curtain my friend I'll make it clear I'll state my case of which I'm certain I've lived a life that's full I've traveled each and every highway and more, much more than this. I did it my way. Regrets, I've had a few, but then again, too few to mention 
I did what I had to do and saw it through without exemption. I planned each charted course, each careful step along the byway and more, much more than this, I did it my way. Yes, there were times, I'm sure you knew, when I bit off more than I could chew. I ate it up and spit it out. I faced it all and I stood tall and did it my way. I loved, I laughed and cried. I've had my fill my share of losing but now as tears subside I find it all so amusing to think I did all that and may I say not in a shy way Ooh, I missed my cue. <laughs> to say the things he truly feels And not the words of one who kneels The record shows I took the blues I did it my way. Beautiful glow. Thank you. Yeah, you did amazing on that. Thank you. Um, Nana wants to know if you've ever sang Beauty no, and the Beast. I haven't, but I should learn that one, right? Yeah. Yes, please. That would be, a, um, I love that song. That is a pretty song. I'll have to yeah. write that down. Yeah, I think yeah. you would knock that one out of the park, too. Well, you do all of them. You knock them all out of the park. You yes. have a beautiful voice. And I believe hey. Lady Campion just did that one, the Beauty and oh, the Beast. Oh, uh -huh. I think Lady the just released yeah. one, I think it was yesterday or something. Yeah, I remember hearing it. Cool. Yeah, that was good. Hey, Steve, -O, did I skip you? <laughs> Tanya. No, you sung okay. one, remember? And I did uh, Show Me the Way I by mean, Sticks. Okay. And it flowed. So now it's back to okay. you. And then I will be doing Show Me the Way by Peter Frampton on my next one. Oh, okay, cool, cool. All right, here we go.
do that to me one more time Once is never enough with a man like you Do that to me one more time I could never get enough of a man like you Whoa Kiss me like you just did Oh baby Do that to me once again Pass it to me one more time once just gives me enough for my heart to be. Tell it to me one more time. I can never hear enough when I got you me. Oh, say those words again, just like you think. Oh, baby. Tell it to me once again Do that to me one more time Once is never enough With a man like you Oh, do that to me one more time I can never get enough Of a man like you Very nice. Yeah. Once. Thank you. Once, Pretty. Once. Thank you. I'm just kind of pulling up what my iPad's pulling up. Don't have a lot of time to search with three of us. <laughs> Thank you, Purple. Thank you, Charlotte. Yeah, that was real nice. I appreciate it. All right. It's so. Good. It's addicting to get up and sing. You got one, Steve-O? Don't don't Mr. B, go wait until he gets to follow Glow or what? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So here we go with some Peter Frampton. And awesome. I didn't bring the harmonicas out, but I can't do the sounds that he makes on a harmonica anyway. He's not using a harmonica. I wonder how you feel 
there's green in my ears and no one to relate to except the sea. Who can I believe in? I'm kneeling on the floor. It has to be a force. Who drew our phone? The stars are out and shining. But all I really want to know, oh, one of you, show me the way every day. Show me the way. Yeah. I see no reason. You're living on my nerves. When someone drops a cup and I submerge. I'm swimming in a circle. I feel I'm going down. There has to be a fool to play my part. But someone thought of healing. But all I really want to know, oh, won't you show me the way every day? I want you show me the way. Oh, I want you day after day. I'm I feel so unashamed. I can't believe this is happening to me. I watch you when you're sleeping, and then I want to take your love. Oh, won't you show me the way every day? I want you. Show me the way one more time. I want you day after day. day, day. I want you day after day. day. I want you. Show me the way every day. I want you. Show me the way night and day. I want you. Day after day. Hey. Oh. Awesome, Steve-O. That was awesome. Good job. Thank you. I'm being dead tonight. Instead of, instead of boing boing, you're going to hear little pitches. <laughs> <laughs> I'm talking to a friend of mine on Facebook. <laughs> she keeps yeah. digging me even though I told her I'm singing. <laughs> so, oh, no. Okay. Oh, uh, no. Prayers out to Sandy Kirk. She's back in the hospital. Oh, I'm no medical issues but she is back in icu hopefully they're no handle on it but yeah prayers out to sandy kurt yeah definitely oh, thank you i did not know yes y'all please please wow thanks for letting us know yeah sad yeah i heard on deb's earlier on her show that and she'll mention it again tonight on the karaoke, I'm sure. 
but yeah. Thank you. All right, Miss Glow. Okay, so this is another first. I haven't ever sung this song either. Ooh. Trying, to, cool. trying to learn some new ones, you know. So love it. Mm -hmm. Whenever you're ready. Whenever you're ready. It's coming. <clears throat> That's a hard song. No, that was be love. Thank it. you. Thank you. Jeff, yeah. is that Gorgeous. very nice? Thanks. 
Thank you. Mm. Uh -huh. Oh, Jeff needs tissues. If anybody's got any tissues, pass them to Jeff. Oh. <laughs> yeah, that was beautiful. All right, I'm gonna bring it up just a little, so we're not we're not going through too many tissues. Three little birds sat on my window, and they told me I don't need to worry. Summer came like cinnamon, so sweet. Little girls double dutch on the concrete. Maybe sometimes we got it wrong, but it feels right. The more things seem to change, the more they say the same. Oh, don't you hesitate. Carol, put your records on. Tell me your favorite song. You go ahead and let your hair down. Sapphire and faded jeans. I hope you get your dreams. Just go ahead and let your hair down. You're gonna find yourself somewhere, somehow. Blue as the sky. Sunburned and lonely Sipping tea at a bar by the roadside Just relax Don't you let those other boys fool you Gotta love that afro hair, do Maybe sometimes we feel afraid But it's alright when more stay the same The more they seem to change Don't think it's strange Girl, put your records on Tell me your favorite song You go ahead and let your hair down Sapphire and faded jeans I hope you get your dreams Just go ahead and let your hair down you're gonna find yourself somewhere, somehow. Was more than I could take. Pity for pity's sake. Some nights keep me away. I thought that I was stronger. When you're gonna realize that you don't even have to try any longer. Do what you want to, girl. Put your records on. Tell me your favorite song. You go ahead and let your hair down Step out and fade jeans I hope you get your dream Just go ahead and let your hair down Yeah, put your record on Tell me your favorite song You go ahead and let your hair down Step out and fade jeans I hope you get your dream just go ahead and let your hair down. Ooh, you're gonna find yourself somewhere, somehow. Wee! <laughs> Very nice. Charismatically Chris wants to have hair to let down. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much. <laughs> Very nice, Jimmy. Very nice. Thank you. Yeah, that was nice. I don't know that song. No? Ooh. It's uh, Kareem Bailey Ray. Girl, put your record. Well, it's just put your records on. Oh. Yeah. It's fun. It's different. Yeah. Thank you, everybody. I'm trying to get my laptop plugged back in because it's not showing that it's hooked up to the electrical, although it is. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. So I'm going to hook up with the cord. Uh-oh. 
Remember Might the be commercial? Unhappy battery life. <laughs> it's showing half the life on the battery, but it's not showing that the charger's hooked up. And uh -oh. I am plugged in to the electrical. Anyway, all right, let me bring up my next one before I do run out of battery. Right, right. There's another stick song. Thank you, Pam. This one also, there's, there's all kinds of groups out there. Right. Am I still there? You hear me? Yes. Yes, sir. All right. Yeah. All right. So uh, there's all kinds of songs out there named Lady. This is Sticks versions of Lady. Oh, I like this one. Lady, you're with me, my lady. With me, oh, 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 all oh, your love. Your hand, your love when I'm thinking. Touch me, and my troubles all fall. Come on up. All right. I'm going to turn my camera off and I'm going to mute while I try to adjust my electrical. All righty. Okay. And I'm going to rowdy up this live stream. Yeah. Yeah. Let's get ready. Hold on. I'm waiting for it to come up. You're fun. Take it down. Take it down. <clears throat> I've been cheated, been mistreated. When will I be loved? I've been put down. 
down I've been pushed round When will I have love? When I find a new man That I want for mine He always breaks my heart in two It happens every time I've been made blue I've been lied to When will I be loved? When I find a new man That I want for mine He always breaks my heart in two it happens every time i've been treated been mistreated when will i have love when will i have love tell me Seven ten. Right now. <laughs> what did he say? Uh, oh. When you said, "When will I be loved?" He said, "Right now." <laughs> <laughs> Great job! That was so good. Yeah, Steve I love that was good. Yes, Steve almost yeah, my, hit something. Yeah. Uh oh, he hit the wrong button. Mm -hmm. He may have had to redo everything. <laughs> yeah, it went dead. Who knows? Yeah, yeah. I'm going to get Mr. Bean. Yes, I am. Uh-oh. He going to get locked in the basement with 710. <laughs> He's probably tired from last night. <laughs> yeah, maybe so. But that was really good. Really, really good. Thank you. I don't, honest, 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 I don't know if I've ever heard you sing bad. Like, off key oh, or wow. anything. So, well, thank you. <laughs> yeah, I feel honored to have you up here with me. Oh, okay. So, yeah, Penny requested this song. So, okay. Oh, I cracked my whip and it worked. Ta da! Uh, eyes are here, Master Kimmy. <laughs> <laughs> you better be. Please <laughs> don't beat. Please don't beat me. Hello, Mister. Gotcha. You feel oh, it okay? Oh. oh. There it is. <laughs> Can I have another? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'll buy you, Mike. <laughs> I don't have a whip sound on my soundboard. <laughs> oh, it's quite fun. Uh, I don't know about you two. Where, hey, where'd Shivo go? Um, his charging cord wasn't working good, so I don't know if he went dead or hit a button or I don't know. Oh, okay. <laughs> Hopefully he'll be back. Um, did you happen to bring a song with you, or am I gonna have to? Mm -hmm. Oh Lord. I don't think I'm going to sing if I'm going to keep getting spanked. I'm kind of liking this. Okay, I'll stop. <laughs> I'll stop. There you go. Is that better? <laughs> oh, hell. <laughs> you guys ain't right. <laughs> We're just yeah, I can, I can do one for you, honey. Yay. Thank you. Yes, ma'am. Oh. 
hard on the run, keeps a hand on the gun, can't trust anyone. I was so sure I needed was more, tried to shoot out the sun. The days that we raised flew up a page, so damage was done. But I made it through to somebody new, was meant for someone. Girl, leave the boots by the bed We leave in this room Someone needs medical help Mac knows one She's holding this ass Ain't going out to chop Cover me up and know you're enough to use me for good. Put your faith to the test and I tore off your dress in Richmond on high. Well, I sobered up, I swore off that stuff forever this time. Your lover seen I thought it'd be me To help me get home The home was a dream One I'd never seen Till you came along Girl, ain't you dressed by the drive We leave on this room The river runs through Here is this house On its stones Like a piece of driftwood So cover me up I know you're in love Please be forgiven Girl, leave boots by the bed We leave in this room Someone needs medical help The magnolia's wound Stolen this house I ain't going out to chop wood Cover me up, know you're enough to use me for good. Girl, know you're enough to use me for good. Beautiful. <laughs> Thanks. Wow. I've never heard that song. Oh, that's um, Morgan Wallen. Okay, that's New Country. Yeah. Beautiful. I mean, <laughs> Thanks, ladies. I had my eyes closed, and it was just pure. 
Oh. So nice. Yeah. I'm with you, Jeff. YouTube music. Who needs it? <laughs> yeah, y'all make sure to subscribe to Mr. B and Glow. Uh, Steve-O puts out some cool videos of hummingbirds that finally flew away. But, hey, you never know. Some might come back. Yeah. Okay, Steve-O's back. Steve-O's back. <laughs> Okay, uh, oh man, I had the electrical cord working, now it's not working again. Oh well, still running off the battery though. Last time I messed with it, it knocked me out. Uh -oh. All right, well, Penny requested I do this song, so I'm gonna do this one for Penny. <laughs> Is my favorite thing, yeah. Uh huh. I can't wait till I see you again, yeah, yeah. Uh huh. I wanna put on my 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 boogie shoes with you, yeah. I wanna put on my 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 boogie shoes just to be with you. I wanna do it till the sun comes up. Oh yeah. Uh -huh. I wanna do it till I can't get enough. Yeah, yeah. Uh -huh. I wanna put on my, 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 my boogie shoes. It's boogie with you. Well, I wanna put on my, 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 my boogie shoes. It's boogie with you. Well, oh, I wanna put on my 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 little shoes just for you to Yeah, I wanna put on. My, 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 my baby shoes Just to give it to Yeah, I wanna put on My, 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 my baby shoes Just to give it to Yeah, I wanna put on My, 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 my baby shoes Just to give it to I wanna put on My, 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 my baby shoes Just to give it to Awesome. Fun. I love that song. <laughs> Thank you. That was fun. Um, all right, we got Noel. Hi. You do? Now I am back and now and I didn't know. And I didn't break who, nothing who, who this time. Turn it on. I need to find a song. Oh Yay. my god. Hang on, Noel. You did you didn't break anything. That's amazing. I know. First time you ever done that song. I didn't break something in the studio. <laughs> <laughs> uh, no way, well, well I broke mine. Uh, what? I broke my electrical I connector, so I'm going to drop off on here. And I guess tonight I'll be on my oh. phone because I got to buy me a new no. electrical adapter. Oh, oh no. no. It's, fine. it's just the adapter that goes between the laptop and the cord itself. Yeah. Uh -huh. Oh, yeah. That little adapter piece is shot, so I got to get a new one of those. Oh, so I'm gonna drop off. We'll see y'all later. Okay. Yeah. Thank you for coming. You out. You're welcome. See y'all later. Bye. Night. Night. All right, Noel, you got time to get a song and this song will be glow, then Mr. B and then you. So you got plenty of time. Okay. Okay. So it's my turn. Yes, ma'am. Already it goes quick when there's not many there's of us. Not many of us. I know. I like that. <laughs> You're not to wait ten hours. To ten I'm minutes. sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> Hold on. It's coming. It's coming. This mule is slow tonight.
I lay my head on the railroad track Waiting on the double E But the train don't run by here no more Poor, poor, pitiful me Poor, poor, pitiful me Poor, poor, pitiful me All these boys won't let me be Lord, have mercy on me Whoa, whoa, is me Well, I met a man out in Hollywood Now I ain't naming names Well, he really worked me over good Just like Jesse James Yes, he really worked me over good He was a credit to his gender Put me through some changes, Lord Sort of like a wearing blender Poor, poor, pitiful me Poor, poor, pitiful me Oh, these boys won't let me be Lord, have mercy on me Whoa, woe is me Well, I met a boy in the borough queues Down in Yokohama He picked me up and he threw me down He said, please don't hurt me, mama Poor, poor, poor me Poor, poor, pitiful me Oh, these boys won't let me be The Lord have mercy on me Whoa, whoa, is me. Poor, poor, poor me. Poor, poor, pitiful me. Poor, poor, poor me. Poor, poor, pitiful me. Poor, poor, pitiful me Poor, poor, pitiful me Well done, honey. Thank you. Good song, too. Mm -hmm. Who sings that? Linda Ronstadt. Thank you. Okay. Yeah. Thank you. I'm doing a okay. bunch of her songs now. Mm -hmm. Well, because you sound a lot like her. Olivia Newton John, all those good songs. Right. Love it. Thanks. Well, Mr. B, yeah, you about ready? Yeah. yeah. I'm gonna have to crack the whip. No, I'm I'm getting it. I'm getting it. <laughs> oh, I couldn't take it back. Hold on. There you go. Oh, thanks. Kiss, kiss the boo boo. <laughs> All right, we did some country. Let's do some other side of the spectrum. A little bit of April wine. Ooh. Time and time again I see A love that seems strong Was not meant to be Broken heart always meant Left to unsure To try love again Just between you and me Baby, I know Between you and me, always I know what love will 
It's high, but you did amazing. Like it. <laughs> yeah, it's mm. beautiful. Thanks, guys. Yes. Thanks for coming in, Black Watch. Good to see you. Hello, Black Watch. Woo-hoo. Oh, gee, Nana said she missed your singing, Mr. B. Oh, thanks, guys. Hey, BW, good to see you. Well, Miss Noel, are you ready to sing a song for us? Yes. All right. Uh, no, I am not going to be live tomorrow, but Miss Deb will be on tomorrow at 1030 Eastern. All right, you can get started whenever you want to. Shopify helps you sell at every stage of your business. Commercials. You know everybody went with money back then. I mean, they're like, here's some baby on baby drop ever since, baby. Oh, no, it was true. Nobody dropped shit. Let's go. Huh? I need to see shit with some money. I need to see shit with some money. I need to see shit with some money. Yeah. <laughs> 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 
is it has to be a karaoke song not like an original song playing just a karaoke song but that was that was cool yeah oh. she dropped down not like singing and going well yeah, I don't think you would have got shut down because I really couldn't understand it anyway. It was so yeah, so static. Yeah, I was trying to adjust things, but it just wasn't working. So, yeah. um, all right. Do you think we'll be able to get in what two more songs, or do we need to just do one more song each so we can make it to Debs? It's up to you. It's your show, Web. Your show. You got the whip. <laughs> I can sing all night. I'm going to sing all night. <laughs> we'll say, we'll, we'll try to squeeze in two of them since there's just three of us. How's that? Okay. Okay, awesome. Oh, and it's my turn. Duh. Yeah. <laughs> all right. Never seen you looking so lovely as you did tonight. I've never seen you shine so bright. Mm -hmm. I've never seen so many women ask you if you want to dance. They're looking for a little romance, given half the chance. I've never seen the dress you're wearing. Or the highlights in your hair when it catch your eyes. I've been blind, lady in red. Is dancing with me, cheek to cheek. There's nobody here. Just you and me, that's where I want to be, but I hardly know that beauty by my side. 
seen your shine so bright you are amazing I've never seen so many people want to be there by your side and when you turn to me and smile took my breath away I have never had such a feeling such a feeling of complete and out of love as I do tonight, the lady in red is dancing with me, cheek to cheek, there's nobody here. He's such a pretty boy. He is a pretty boy. Yeah. A beautiful boy. Looks like he's smiling. <laughs> I know it does. <laughs> so cute. Did you get everything fixed? All right. So I'm on my phone now, so I can't see chat no more. Oh. And I wanted to try this. It's been a while since I've had to play the music off the Kindle, so. Mm. It'll probably interfere with the mic. So let's see how this one goes. Is it my turn? Yes, sir, it is. Okay. Oh, Wanted to come up and see if this works or not before I head over to Dev's. Lineman for the county, and I drive the blue to me the sun for another overload. I hear you singing in the wild. I can hear you through the wild. And the witches all lying. You're still on the line. I know I need a small vacation, but I don't. It don't look like rain. 
streets, snows that stretch down south won't ever stand the strain. And I need you more than I do. And I want you for. And the widget all lying is still on the line <laughs> and i need you more than want you and i want you for all time and the witch of all line is still on the Okay, Come on, Kendall, stop. Run away, oh, run away. Yeah. All right, got it. <laughs> the, only thing, yeah, the only thing I did, Steve-O, was turn up your volume, and I had to do the echo cancellation because without it, when you sang, it kind of muted the music a little. But that was okay, all I did. Cool. Yeah. Yep. Oh, I do need to set the echo cancellation. Okay. Yeah, I turned it. I switched it back for you before. Like right after you were done, but yeah, I right. unchecked and turned up the volume. Okay. Was- All right, because I know when I'm on the laptop, they say I guess not to do it, and now on my right. phone, I know I have to do it. So. Right, bro. Yeah. Even on your laptop, when you're on my show, I I I adjust your vo- levels. Right. Okay. I, I always take your echo cancellation off, and then I turn you up to max, two hundred percent, and it usually blends oh, okay. the music perfect. Hmm. All righty. Well, now I'm on the phone, so it's going to be a little different. I might go on to Deb's on the computer, on the laptop, and just run it out of battery. <laughs> yeah, I, I, would I already talked to my daughter. She's going to try to get me that piece tomorrow. Nice. And she's got to work. She works tonight, and then tomorrow she's off during the day, so she can go get it at Best Buy or wherever. Oh, good. Nice. All, all it is is – here, let me show you guys. I know. the pink here's, here's the power cord. Yeah. Okay, come from the wall to the computer and it's got this little adapter thingy right here mm-hmm. and this uh, little dude right here this piece right here is bent I and i think it's lost its connection inside because it's yeah like way bent but this Ooh. side's okay i'm hoping <laughs> but yeah, yeah this one plugs into that and so mm-hmm. this is what i need is this one uh, gotcha. All right. so hopefully she'll find one for me tomorrow i hope so I have a that so ma'am. All right, next. <laughs> Are you ready, Miss Flo? Are you there? Did we lose her? I don't know. Can you hear no. us, Flo? Or to glow. Hello. What do we do? Oh no. We Hello. lost Glow. This is God <laughs> speaking. It's time for you to sing. <laughs> don't make me smite you. <laughs> Uh oh. 
I think we lost her, guys. Um, Glow, we cannot hear you. I don't know why, but we cannot. Bro. Yeah, she asked in the back chat, can you hear me? I said, no. <laughs> no. I'm hoping she can hear us at least. No, well, maybe she'll can... drop down and come back up. Yeah, we can do that. Go if you can hear us. I'll go on to Mr. B and you can. Okay. She said she needs to reboot. No, Okay. We go on to Mr. I'll just do one more since we're getting late on time. Okay. Sounds great to me. Thank you. You're welcome, honey. A little bit of Matchbox 20. my favorite Matchbox 20 song. Same. She says it's cold outside as she hands me a raincoat. She always worried about things like that. Said it's all going in and might as well be my fault. She only sleeps when it's raining. She screams, voices dream. She says, baby, it's 3 a.m. I must be lonely. She says, baby, now. I can't help but tell you that all oh, sometimes Rain's gonna wash away, I believe it She got a little bit of something God is better than nothing And it's all the poor in the world She believes she got it all and all Swears the moon don't hang quite as high as it used to She only sleeps when it's raining And she screams The voice is strange She says, baby It's three and I must be lonely She says, baby yeah, I can't help but be scared of Oh, sometimes Rain's gonna wash away, I believe Yeah <coughs> She believes that life is made up of all that she's used to Clock on the wall has been stuck three days and days. She thinks of happiness, a match sits on her doorway. Outside, stop raining. She says, baby, stream must be lonely. Says, baby, yeah. I can't help but get it all oh, sometimes. Walk away, I believe it. Three in the must be lonely. Yes, she says, baby, now. I can't help but get it all oh, sometimes. Awesome. Very nice, Mr. B. Very nice. 
Thank Can y'all hear me now? Yes, ma'am. Yes, we hear you, Glow. Okay. <laughs> that was weird. All of a sudden, all my sound went away. Hmm. Thank you so much, Mr. B, for coming up. I know you were gone and then got home, and I appreciate your effort. I really yeah, do. Absolutely, absolutely. We love you, Mr. B. I love you, too. Thank you, Thank you Mr. B. <laughs> <laughs> All right, honey, I'll drop down to chat, let you guys finish up the show. It's some okay, Thank you. <laughs> Love you. Bye. Bye. My uh, turn? I, yes, ma'am. Okay. I feel so bad I've got a worried mind I'm so lonesome all the time Since I left my baby behind all blue by you Saving nickels, saving times Working till the sun don't shine Looking forward to happier times on blue by you. I'm going back someday. Come what may to blue by you. Where the folks are fine and the world is mine on blue by you. Fishing boats with their sails afloat. If I could only see that familiar sunrise, those sleepy eyes, how happy I'd be. Gonna see my baby again. Gonna be with some of my friends Baby, I feel better again On Blue Bayou Saving nickels, saving dimes Working till the sun don't shine Looking forward to happier times on Blue Bayou I'm going back someday Come what may to Blue Bayou Where the folks are fine And the world is mine on Blue Bayou where those fishing boats with their sails afloat If I could only see That familiar sunrise Those sleepy eyes How happy I'd be The silver moon and the evening tide Oh, some sweet day Gonna take away this hurt and Well, I'll never be blue My dreams come true Very nice glow. Thank you. Holy cow. Yeah, that's a hard song. It but is a hard song. Yeah, my but vocals are good for that. Yeah. You nailed it. You nailed it. Thank you. Wow. Right there. Right there. 
You just ah, buddy. <laughs> we have what Hold nine on. minutes? They want to see you, buddy. You have to already yeah. see you. There you go. Hey, buddy. I want to pet him so bad. <laughs> no. Hold his Petting face. Pet me. <laughs> Are you his smiling eyes. at us? He's smiling. Yes, his eyes are gorgeous. Yep. Now that see the ya, hummingbirds buddy. are gone, I'll probably be getting videos of him playing out in the yard. Yes, yeah, that's going to be my next. Yeah. My next set's going to be Buddy running around the yard, huh, Buddy? That'll be awesome. Stand up. cool. Okay. Oh. And there he goes. He's gone. Is that a, is that a husky? Uh, He's on. All right, guys. Yeah, I, said that I will husky. see you later. Steve he is a husky. Yeah. Is it a husky? Yes. Yes, I thought so. I had the uh, DNA done on him, and he's 90%. Siberian Husky and 10% Alaskan Malamute. Oh, wow. Both so beautiful animals. Yeah. A 90 10 yeah. split. <laughs> a 90 10 split. Uh, uh, that is so cool. He's beautiful. He is yeah. beautiful. But yeah, we did do the DNA right after we got him and it came back 90% Siberian Husky, 10% Alaskan Malamute. Cute. That's cool. Very cute. All right. Well, yes, we don't have much longer. Everybody can take a break before Miss Deb. And um, thank you so much too for coming up here. And Mister B, I really appreciate it. And the saying no goes, in the, the we'll saying goes later. in the help. Okay, the saying goes right. in the help. You is kind. You is smart, and you is important. And that's how I feel about you guys. So thank you Aww, so much you. for sharing the last couple hours with me. And, and thank I you for coming. I appreciate it. Oh, yeah, of course. <laughs> yes. Well, thank you so much. Y'all have a good night. And hopefully we'll see you, you over at Miss Tips. Love you guys. Okay. See ya. Night. Night. Good night. <laughs>